a good day. You chose a good day, Spotify. <laughs> Just Sleepy Hollow. I'm with Rap Caviar, and it's a day in the life. Damn. Anything healthy I eat, bro, I be hungry like five minutes later. You about to play ball. Ain't no method, bro. I'm just being myself. When I play ball, though, I never time I lose it. This shit feel like a real court, though. I don't want to play them industry games. These niggas playing. I'm good off all out. Ah! You missed the pass, bro. He's scared. Oh, my God! You don't got no substance here, shit. Niggas gonna forget about you. Game was 16. We won. But you know when you win, and you be like, yo, game 21, game 21. Ah, uh, you let the losers, you come you get the losers a chance. And they won, but I don't count, because game was 16. I be so hard on myself when I get in the booth. Like, I just want to get better. Let's get it. There's a million different ways you can get better. You just got to be you and work. Whatever you think is going to make you better, go ahead and do it. You just wait for a I bet. Now. I'm about to get a drink. Good to see you. Nice surprise. Thank you. <laughs> Marsha, chop out. Yeah! Yo, my heart. Cause you look at Ernie Steve. Ah! <laughs> my son just touched down, bro. My son crossed. Don't fuck around, okay? I just see you, bro. No emotion, bro. Chicken saute, crispy shrimp, vegetable rolls. I ain't gonna front. Peanut butter sauce, you gotta try that. That shit is different. You're supposed to go to the studio now. That was the beginners. Facts. He really be like telling me, like, yo, bro, you got this shit, bro. Like, that was what? I ain't gonna front. Bro, it was mad motivation. I was working, 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 then I got locked up. So it was like, all right, whatever I got left, just put that shit in the album and just drop it. But that didn't work out. So I came back. I'm working, working, working. I found like a certain amount of songs. I'm like, yo, this is gonna be the album. The album is gonna be Boy Meets World. I'm gonna use a few songs from when I, before I got locked up and a couple songs from when I came home. I done been through mad shit during the making of this shit. So I just went with that. And it's funny because I had that title before I went to jail and I'm just like, yo, that might be a weird title. So I'm like, nah, I'm just finding something else. And when I came home, I'm like, nah, bro, I'm using it. I gotta use it. Action! Come on, come on, come on. Let me take you around, let me take you around. Yeah, I think it was like a picture. I think it was like an original picture of Chef. And he just drew that shit. He sat there and did that. At the show, I'm like, nah, that's fire. I need one of those. Yeah, free bro. What I'm most excited about with the new album is probably getting on um, people's reaction on Damn and another record called the Driver's Seat. Self Control too. Yeah, really just the feedback from the fans. That's that's really it. I feel like I, I leveled up in those songs. Whatever genre my mood take me to, I, I'm gonna just do it. I don't realize that. Inspired my songs until after I do it. Oh, in the moment of my, while I'm doing it, you feel me? Like, I like to talk about like real life. Something that I'm going through, or maybe I make a song with for somebody I know feelings, just to, just because I felt it so much that I'm all right, but it's easy to look at other people's stuff and be like, damn, ah, uh, but it ain't, it ain't you, it ain't them. You gotta work on your shit. They doing what they supposed to do. I don't never switch my way of doing things because I feel like everybody got their own everything on thing. <laughs> I'm a doing shows type of guy. I love doing shows. See people holding up the sign. I had one show, music cut off. Bro, they start throwing their phone. I guess they, they want me to make videos and shit. They start throwing their phones on stage. Boom, boom, boom. I'm like, nah, nah, nah. I had to step to the side, bro. Like, yo, bro, y'all wildin', bro. What the f what I'm gonna do? Like, that should be crazy. I'm about to crowd surf one of these days, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I'm jumping in there, they gotta catch me though. This is the first one, D-Van? Yeah. I ain't gonna front, I ain't think this song would've been like that. I just did it as like a freestyle. Yeah, it went gold, yeah, then it, it went platinum. Though, right after that? I oh, think no. after that was 2055, yeah. yeah.
when you rapping off a beat that's already made, it's like, it's like I'm in a box. I feel like when I make my own beat, I can just do whatever. I can make the beat go up, down. I feel like that's the best way to work. When you working with a in the house, so yeah. you can tell each other whatever. Like, yo, look, I don't like it like this, for me. Yeah, we go through mad beats, bro. Nah, we beat, try it out. Nah, that ain't it. That ain't nice. it. We here. Sometimes I don't even be feeling right about my track if he don't be, if he not in there on some, yo. <laughs> Sometimes you be chilling, he just, you probably tired for the day, you mellow. I'm like, damn, this shit probably dirt. Nobody yeah. really knows when it's a hit, but we, we definitely be having good feelings about certain ones. I guess a lot of shit on this new shit that we got good yeah, feelings about. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. We probably say, yo, this shit gonna go crazy, or this type of crowd gonna love a song like this. We never know where it's gonna go. What success is to me, generational wealth. You want that, you want your kids, kids, kids to be, you know I me? Mean? And not just over music, or for like businesses, all types of shit. Generational wealth, just put a stamp on it. Boy Meets World dropping September 15th. More plaques, more winning. It's crazy, cause I don't think nothing belong on pizza, bro. I used to throw the pineapples on this shit. As a kid, that was a vibe right there.